The show is called Mom on Skype at Brooklyn's Irondale, a theater ensemble performing in a church in Fort Greene. These young performers are from Ukraine's School of Open-Minded Kids Studio Theater in Lviv. Two months after the invasion began, these children were performing these songs and monologues about family separation as bombs were dropping, and that caught the attention of this Brooklyn theater company. I read an article in the paper about uh, them doing a show in a bomb shelter in Lviv. And I thought, if anything shows the importance of art to a community of people, that does. There are bombs falling outside the window, and what do they choose to do to put on a play? It was much more than a 26-hour trek to Brooklyn via Poland. There was a three-year wait for visas until Senator Chuck Schumer and Representative Hakeem Jeffries stepped in to speed up the process. This month-long trip is costing close to $40,000, mostly raised through private donations. And these children want the world to know what living in Ukraine is like. I want that... All people will know that it's not normal life in Ukraine now. It's always an alarm. You, you need to sleep in a bomb shelter, and it's not okay. Besides the play, these Ukrainian children went to see the sights of New York City, including Coney Island. It was so scary, but it's so cool, and it's a good memories. Twelve-year-old Hannah wrote this patriotic song about Ukraine and is hoping people understand why their fundraising goal is to buy a fighter jet to help protect their homeland.